Hello, Grade 6. This is Let's Go Unit 2. Unit 2 at the aquarium. At the aquarium. Aquarium, ya ulad, al huwa matḥaf lil ahya al maya. It's a place where where you can see sea animals. Okay. Okay. Now let's start with the conversation and this conversation between Scott and Kate. Okay. What a great day. A great. It's an adjective. What a great day. Ya lahu min yawm an azim. It sure was. It sure was. Naam, kan fa'lan yawm azim. But I am tired now. I am tired. It's also an adjective. Bas ana ta'abain aw mutab now, dilwakti. Me too. We really walked a lot. Walked in its a past. It comes from walk. Okay, walk present. Walked past. Notice we added a d as we said before. Past verb plus e d, and this of course with regular verbs. The ma'a el af'al el montazma. Okay. Notice subject be adjective. El fa'al i. Verb to be am is our adjective. Okay, I am happy. Ana mafsoot. I am tired. Maybe I am tired. Okay. Okay. Then Kate, what did you like best? This question in the past because we see here did. So we know that it's in the past. What did you like? And the main verb here is in infinitive. What did you like best? I think I liked verb plus ed here. It's in the past. I like the penguins best. penguins. These are penguins. They were. They were. Were also in the past. Okay. It comes from or in present verb to be in the past where they were cute and the cute also an adjective cute here come in your sofa they were cute what about you i liked the sharks these are sharks i like i liked the sharks they were scary scary it's also an adjectives but here i am describing sharks sifa bitasif el ash yani ay haga ghir aqal okay wana atkalam an el juz'iya di bit tafsil dilwati okay bas lana aizaku taghdu balku minu hena are present where past okay what a great day it sure was what a great day it sure was عايزه اقول حاجه مهمه يا اولاد في اول يونت 2 هي ايه انا عندي صفات بتنتهي ب اي دي ات ديسكرايبس بيبول دي بتصف الانسان لكن عندي ادجكتيفز بتصف بتنتهي ب اي ان جي ات ديسكرايبس ثينجز maybe يعني ايه things يعني الاشياء يعني ايه الاشياء يعني اي شيء غير عاقل maybe animals films uh, movies اي حاجه المهم مش شخص عاقل لكن اي صفه بتنتهي بإي دي بتصف الانسان شخص عاقل اوكي okay? now we have finished finished the conversation now let's start to these pictures okay and remember adjective plus ed describes people okay adjectives plus ing describes things don't forget it's very important okay and here look at the picture she was amazed adjective plus ed so it describes people she was amazed the penguins were amazing adjective plus ing 
It describes penguins. The penguins were amazing. Number two, he was, he was pooed. Describes people. The movie was pouring. Describe things. Again, adjective plus ed describe people. Adjective plus ing describe things. Okay. Now, this picture, number three, she was interested. Describe people. The book was interesting. Describe the book. Number four, he was tired. Describe the boy. The race, Sibé, was tiring. Mutaib. Describe the race. Okay? The next picture, number five. He was excited. Describe people. The right, Rukuba, was exciting. Can it Muthira? Describe the right. She was scared. Describe people. Scared. The shark was scary. Describe the shark. Okay? Okay, now let's repeat after me. Let's learn new words. Number one, an aquarium. Aquarium. Number two, a tour. A tour. Number three, a lecture. A lecture. Number four, an exhibit. An exhibit. Number five, a shark. A shark. Number six, an octopus an octopus okay and notice here i put a before singular noun and before where this starts with the consonant but here i put in before singular noun start with the vowels like e a i o u okay now Let's uh, read together. Andy and and Jenny had it's in the past a great day. Can I do new Malzim at the aquarium? All the exhibits called the Marudot were and here we use were because exhibit is a plural noun. Okay, we're exciting, exciting. It describes exhibit. What was scary? What was interesting? What was amazing? What was tiring? Okay? And remember this sentence. The shark was scary. Okay? The shark was scary. I use was because shark is a singular noun. The shark was scary. And again, these adjectives describe things not uh, people okay it ends with ing except scary again repeat after me scary interesting amazing tiring okay the next picture like practice it's habit amazing amazed i will answer number one the shark is we're amazing. He was amazed. Okay, number number three. The lecture was boring. He was booted. And this sentence, the exhibit was amazing. She was amazed. Okay, answer these pictures by yourself. Okay, now let's learn some new words number one a jellyfish a jellyfish number two a sea turtle a sea turtle number three a squid a squid okay number four a video a video number five a ride a ride number six a beetle boat a beetle boat and remember we use a before singular noun not plural noun make sentences the children here it's plural noun so we used where the children were talking about the aquarium what did they say here 
we see did it means this question in the past and the main verb is in infinitive don't forget the sea turtle turtles are amazing or it means this sentence in present okay the turt sea turtles are amazing the jellyfish is boring the ride is uh, exciting the pedal boat is uh, tiring okay is was or where present past don't forget okay and all these verbs verb to be okay we will answer this question this question what did they say so the answer will be in the past so the answer is for example sorry they said and I will complete again what did they say the main verb is infinitive but when I answer I put the verb in the past they said here I will talk about each person and I had Kellen Ba and Kolo Shoks Fatib al Igabel Wahdaha. For example, Kate said and said is in the past and it's not regular verb. It's an irregular verb. The fan shays. I shake it on a hot touch of a past the tail e d. La hoa assassin can e can see. Baa said. Kate said the sea turtles were amazing. We're amazing. Okay. طيب هقول هنا على مثلا لو قلنا ان ده هناخد ده مثلا اندي اندي said the ride was exciting okay and you can answer the rest by yourself okay now let's read the sentence he said he was amazed he said here I am talking in the past he was amazed she said the squid was scary the squid was scary i'm amazed the squid is scary she is excited the lecture is pouring okay for example here he said or she said she was excited she was excited okay Okay, and you can answer the rest by yourself. He is scared. He is scared. The video is interesting. The pedal boat is tiring. They are tired. The sea turtle turtles are amazing. Are amazing. The ride is exciting. Okay. What do you think is exciting? I think that the uh, ride is exciting. I think the ride is exciting. What do you think is boring? I think maybe the video or uh, the video is boring or sorry. Which one is boring? I think the literature is uh, boring. Okay? Now, let's uh, listen and read along, then read again. Waves. Waves, the old lady, the old These are waves. Waves in a bottle. I'm wag, fizugaka. And I'm in a zaydi. Let's read. Do you like to look at waves? Habit bossa ala el amwag? When you go to the beach, لما بتروح للشاطئ, you can look at waves. ممكن تبص على الأمواج in a bottle too. في زجاجة, okay? A bottle, water in a bottle. Number one, first, أولا, wash a bottle, اغسل إزازة, so you can reuse. ممكن تعيد استخدامها تاني. Use يا ولاد لوحدها كده. Use يستخدم. طبعا أنا عايز أقول يعيد استخدام. Reuse. ودي هتقابلنا في أفعال كتيرة. So you can reuse it. Put some water and a little blue color. Put ضع 
some water بعضل ما and a little blue color ولون أزرق يعني مش كتير يعني a little into the bottle في الإزازة number two next put oil هتحط إيه زيت put oil into the bottle you can put in some glitter ممكن تحط بعض الجلتر كده number three put some glue حط شوية سمغ كده around the bottle cap على الغطاء بتاع الإزازة and close the bottle واقفل بقى الإزازة close it tight يعني جامد قوي بشدة okay color in the bottle when you move the bottle you will see waves لما تيجي تحرك الإزازة هتشوف الأمواج تمام okay choose the about first new words waves waves reuse reuse oil glitter glitter choose a correct answer what do you do first wash the bottle or close the water uh, close the bottle هتبقى wash the bottle number two what do you do last wash the bottle or close the bottle close the bottle okay understand the vocabulary first first wash the bottle so that you can remember reuse it to read استخدامها what does reuse mean wash uh, wash the bottle so that you can reuse reuse يعني يرجع يستخدمها تاني number b wash so that you can reuse ask your partner اسأل زميلك Do you like to go to the beach? تحب تروح للشاطئ? Yes. What do you like to do at the beach? If I am talking about myself, I like to build sand castles. Okay. And you can ask your partner. Listen and write. Do you hear O I O O O? Coin C O I N. Book B O O. Oil O I. Cook C O O. Look L O O. Learn about words. Read and write. You can use a bottle. Wash a bottle so that you can reuse. Notice. Use, reuse. We use before the verb. This is a verb. Use, and we put R E. So we have a new verb. Reuse. Read it. اللي هي إيه يا أولاد? R E plus read. Review. اللي هي إيه? R E plus view. Replay, R E plus play. Okay, remix, R E plus mix. Okay, let's listen and check. Okay, number one. Watering, uh, sorry, feeding the fish. Number B. Number two, watering the plants. B. Number three. Sitting on a bench. C. Number four. Uh, drinking some water. C. Okay. Listen and check. What did they say? Okay. Number one. Scared. I'm scared. Number two. The film is exciting. Number A also. Now let's listen and check. Number one, she's scared. She's scared. She said she's scared. Number two, she said it's very pouring or it's pouring. Number B. Now let's read about pyramids. These are pyramids. Mystery hunters. Mystery hunters. Matt and Megan's blog. Huge rayons, the marsh deep. 
there are many pyramids around the world في أهرامات كتير حول العالم you can see pyramids in Egypt in Africa in Greece اللي اليونان in Mexico and in China وفي الصين the most famous pyramids are in Egypt يعني أكثر الأهرامات شهرة في مصر the largest pyramids are is in or the largest pyramid is in Mexico أضخم أو أكبر هرم هو في المكسيك لكن أشهر الأهرامات هي في مصر but the oldest pyramids أقدم أهرامات may be under water تحت الماء divers اللي هم الغواصين have found rayons لقوا زي حطام أو دمار أو بقايا in the ocean في المحيط near Japan بالقرب من اليابان they think هم اعتقدوا ايه they have found a very old city لقوا مدينة قديمة قوي some of the rayons بعض الحطام ده look like pyramids يبدو يعني يشبه كده الاهرامات who built the underwater city مين اللي بنى المدينة اللي تحت المية دي Okay, مين اللي بناها؟ Who built the underwater city? Why did it sink? ليه غاصت؟ ليه غرقت تحت؟ Was there an earthquake? اللي هو زلزال؟ هل كان في زلزال؟ فعشان كده هي غرقت تحت؟ Did the ocean rise? هل المحيط هو العلي وارتفع؟ It's a mystery. ده سر، ده حاجة غامضة. New words and please repeat after me. Famous. Famous diver, diver, rayons, rayons, sink, sink, earth, cook, earth, cook, rise, rise, mystery, mystery. Your turn. Have you ever seen a pyramid? For me, yes. Why do you think people built pyramids? In my opinion, maybe they. Believed, يعني كانوا بيعتقدوا أو بيؤمنوا أو بيصدقوا في in life after death في الحياة بعد الموت. Why did the underwater pyramids sink? I think maybe because the ocean rise. I think maybe the ocean rise, rise, rose, the ocean. Rose, rose. The ayah ulad liyal past men rise, rise, rose, risen. What did you think? The sticker A. Write your opinion. I am right. I write here my opinion. Okay. So now we have finished. Let's go unit two. See you again in unit three. Bye.